So we're almost there. All one can see, a look of utter focus on the faces of all involved. You've been there, Jim Beglin. What will they be thinking as they wait for the whistle? Well, you're right, Peter, I have been in this position, and the message is usually something like, remember all the work, the hard work you've put in to get this far. So don't leave anything out there now. Do what you're good at. It's better than what they can offer. Stick to that, and you hope it'll be enough. Audience, they say, some 300 million. We have terrific scenes in front of us at the Estadio do Dragao, one of the biggest venues in Portugal. So we're almost there. All one can see, a look of utter focus on the faces of all involved. You've been there, Jim Beglin. What will they be thinking as they wait for the whistle? Well, you're right, Peter, I have been in this position, and the message is usually something like, remember... Set a goal! A great save, real class. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. There's the delivery. Tries to get it clear. And it's played forward. De Bruyne. Now it's Gundogan. Into Milan, starting the game with good energy, looking to take control of proceedings if they can. Here it comes. Gets the better of his man. Walker plays it forward. Mares goes looking. Up he gets! There it is! That could turn out to be a big, big goal! What a great header, got plenty on that. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Well, Peter, the emphasis should now switch to winning it rather than even thinking about losing it. A Serbi gets it out to the wing. All the way back, and they start again. Damian. Forward it goes. Hardly anything between the sides, and the score is 1 0. Mukitarian. That's surely a foul free kick. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score, and obviously he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? There could be trouble here. And for now, the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. Gem! An absolute gem! Inter are back 
in business. Oh, that is a bit special. to Milan, grab the equaliser, and we're all square. Well, they just couldn't have responded any better, Peter. Yeah, there's the old cliche about how teams can lose focus after scoring, but you still have to take your chances. Brilliant. Ederson sends that a long way. Questions were asked. Given the answers, the accusatory stare there tells the whole story. Manchester City just had to make the ball stick, but came up short. Gundogan, Greenish plays a clever pass, knocks it away. And it's Stones. He's making... Oh, he's certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. Well, they're struggling to cope with a, a pacey dribble because they've not been at it as a team. I think the collective pressure needs to be better all around. Well, that looks like a final warning, still no card. get his head on that but couldn't score well being able to generate that amount of activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone out tries to get it forward quickly Has a pop! Goal! Inter! And the comeback is complete! Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. This is what we've been waiting for. Yeah, for me, this team seems to find it easier to attack than defend, but now they're going to need to dig in at the back a bit. Ruben Diaz. Rodri. Approaching half-time and still behind. Can they make something happen now? Well, that's where he wants it. Brozovic. Martinez. Should have been made to pay. <laughs> Marti and Martinez. Thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. And they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled.
Well, that has changed the dynamic somewhat. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Grealish. Grealish to hold himself at it. And it's De Bruyne. And that has been cleared. Rotary. Tries lifting it over. Oh, it's Gundogan. Up for the header! It's in! Deep into first half stoppage time, a crucial goal. Great header, made it look easy. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the area of the palm, this fella is definitely no sledge. We have got ourselves... Well, there's the whistle. The first half of the final has flown by. Half time in the final, Jim. How do you read it? Manchester City are in desperate need of some character and inspiration. And we're on the way. Well, it seems like the perfect situation for fortune favouring the brave. 45 minutes to pack in enough risk-taking to get this match turned around. It's very doable. What about that, Tim Beglin? It's really a problem when that much time is afforded in the penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier. This has become one superb game of football. Well, from such a showpiece final as well, I think this is exactly the type of excitement that all the neutrals would have wanted on show. There's so many twists and turns in this game, it's a pleasure to watch. Mares. Mares! Oh, that is rather wayward. Manchester City just served up a reminder of how good they can be on the break. Their method is clear. Battles to win it back. Ruben Diaz. Mares finds himself offside. De Bruyne. It's a decent ball. And Mores! He scored! Well, this guy is just not your average footballer. Alert and sharp. And while one or two others were still digesting the manager's half time team talk, he's already delivering another lead. What a good player. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway.
So we have a breakthrough. Now, how will things develop from here? No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Keeps everyone guessing. Krosovic hoists it forward. Lukaku plays it out to the flank. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. And Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. It just has to be done. Martinez. Back to the keeper. Kyle Walker. Ruben Diaz sends it forward. A Serbi. And it's Mkhitaryan. This is Martinez! And he's there to make a great save. Martinez is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Ederson gets it upfield. Played into space out wide. Mares has it in a wide position, so what next? Great lead! Good delivery, but no joy. I have to commend the wing play, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. We have got changes here from both sides, in fact. Brozovic plays it out to the wing. Looking for space out wide. Chance to... Has a hit! <laughs> Plenty waiting in the middle. Lovely feet. Goes for the cross. Up to meet it! Keep calm and carry on. That Dzeko hits it! And that could come back to haunt them. Dzeko is looking pretty upset with himself. It should have been a leveller. Correa! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Inter were again presented with an opportunity to break and look very, very threatening. Time for changes on both sides, actually. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. And it's got through. Cut out in the nick of time. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Throw it. Brozovic can hoist it clear. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. That's a foul, no two ways about it. <laughs> and that's been leave it clear. Manchester City probably could have killed things off, but they should be okay here. 
Dzeko. Oh, stitch defending, but that'll do. Phillips. Fourth official showing that there will be three minutes of added time. Dzeko gets on the end, has a pop! And for a moment, time stood still. Time is up, and there goes the whistle. Simply, the big day was their day. A day for them and their fans. A truly proud line in their history. So, on to centre stage come the central characters. The individuals who, as a team, blended into champions. And this is their moment.